Oh, hi guys, Sky Christian 90. Let's play Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic. In the last episode, we got to this plus room thing at the corner of the Sith base. And in this episode, uh, I don't, I don't know if I have one on. My neck's a little close to me. Uh, I want to put a shield on for this one. Let's see. Uh, kind of dueling shield would probably be good, I suppose. But yeah, I want to put some shields on because in this video we're going to start off with probably a pretty very... It can be a very tough fight. One of the tougher fights you can do in Manon, so... Or at least that's always kind of how it's been for me. Anyways, let's slap shields on everyone and... I did it a room early. Alright, well... Alright, we can hack through these droids pretty quickly, I guess. Oh, there's the other droid down already. Look at me, me and Jolie are blue, and T3's red, and stuff. Alright, let's open the door so I can get the shield going. How did you get in here? Wait, I recognize you. Lord Malak was most displeased Sweet when Sweet Jesus, are they actually reusing that line? Well, let me guess. You intend to collect this reward, right? Oh, you're gonna let him finish. Master, give us the honor of aiding you in destroying this enemy of the Sith. See? What did I tell you? As you <laughs> I like how we're looking again. back at Jolie, too. <laughs> we shall remove this thorn from Malak's side once and for all. Alright, obviously I want to get rid of these little bastards before I take off the big guy. Why am... Do I have a mind-affecting thing on? That log good, that's doing. Alright, well, let's take out these, uh... self guys. guys. Hit, anyways. Uh, Force shield. Uh, not totally sure what, um... Oh, I just had to throw that on because why not? The T3 pick it up and hit. Whoa, okay. Jolie, here you go. Alright, we gotta take this guy out. We need to start. Yeah, we haven't even heard him yet. Force wave, sir. Oh, wow, it stunned him! Uh. Alright. Oh, well. Alright. My character did heal on autopilot. Force wave again! Whee! Oh, I didn't stun him that time. Get him on poop. Alright, come on. Let's actually get him. Can I actually... <laughs> Take that, jerk. Although, I should be careful, because I am burning through quite a bit of my force power. Alright, critical strike. He's kind of like, we're kind of like juggling it between me and Jolie. <laughs> kind of funny. Oh, he's getting hurt again, though. Alright, Jolie, you heal yourself now. I have to shield again so I can keep him going. Uh, oh, I didn't mean to- oh. I didn't mean to use the construction kit. I'm gonna just- yeah, it's totally, totally gonna go down. Alright, I don't have any force. Alright, let's activate my shield again. So I can reflect some of his damage. I might have to use some med packs. I'm getting him there. He's almost dead. If I can get another good two hits on him, it looks like he's gonna burn through my hit HP faster than I can. Whoa, that was close. Alright, T3, keep. I'm, I'm just gonna spam these things. Come on, T3. <laughs> T3, you're not my only hope. <laughs> Come on, this, this guy off already. I want to stop making me use. Ooh, I almost died. Alright, I'm just. That's not gonna be enough to get my DVS ones again. I'm just trying to keep my. Okay, there we go. Just trying to keep myself alive. <laughs> T3 was pretty much doing it there. That was really close. Alright, wasted quite a bit of health facts there, but it worked out in the end. Anyways, let's pill for him. Ooh, a crystal. And a Dark Master robe, so... If you're going the Sith route, then there you go. Now you have something spe special. Also, this nerf package didn't do shit, so... Ooh. That is really good. 
I'm going to put that on. That is really good. We're immune to critical hits now. So now, yeah, they can't do bonus damage. Damn, that is actually really good. Um, is there anything I can give any of you? Yeah. All right, let's uh, open up these things, I guess. Uh, ooh, we got two of my advanced med kits, the kits back. That's nice. Uh, <laughs> we got one of the shields again. All right, uh, let me just three and eight. So that is actually pretty good. Well, considering light armor Jedi thing go. Um, it's the same as the Jedi Master, but like se seven five, and then the upgrades that I have already give me good resistances to heat and cold. So, all right, that's what. Whoa. That must have been a serious uh, mine there. Alright, let's open up the footlocker, and we get a data pad. And I believe this is one of the ways you can finish up the, um, the Cellcat Children one, because if we find... Let's see. Blaster detection, pretty cool. Uh, let's see. This is good on droids. Uh, contain the evil to Lake and Nath. Long meditation can keep this powerful crystal from the tainted water. Form the crystal. School. All right. These appear to be personal. It's a dark Jedi master in charge of the Sith base in Manan. It seems the Sith have been trying to turn impressionable young Selkath over to the dark side. Mm. After reading lengthy report, uh, reports on the topic, it seems that the final plan was to use these Selkath to overthrow meh, the current government and install a puppet government that the Sith would dominate. So that's pretty conclusive evidence that the Sith are indeed evil. Also, there's that token we got in the last um, recording. The token and that data pad are two ways, or the, essentially the two light side ways that you can finish the uh, cell cath thing. Also, that guy had some stuff on him, so that was nice. Uh, I'm wondering which one I should use. I'm tempted to use the token because the token we don't know really know much about it yet, but it actually brings up something that we heard from these guys. Uh, I found a young cell cath. Yeah, say so you can do either or, but. Yeah, we found a guy dying from torture. Sasha, this is the pin I gave Gallus when we were children. There is blood on it. You could have found this anywhere. For all we know, you killed Gallus. Sith, we were tortured to death, Sasha. You know it's true. Sasha, I believe them. How else would they have found this pin? I I didn't want to believe it, but I can no longer deny what is known to be true. Gallus is dead. The Sith are responsible. I must apologize for downing you. The Sith are truly as evil as you have claimed. Now I imagine if you give them the data pad, you might have to go through a persuasion check still, but I think it's not a high of a persuasion check. I don't know. We must reward the Sith ones. Thank you, human, for serving us the truth. You have saved us from a terrible mistake. Just be careful with those gifts you've already learned. Beware the dark side, or you may end up betraying your world regardless. It's like, there's a the cool thing about Jolie. He's still a Jedi, in the sense, you know, of his responsibilities or anything like that. He's just, he'll keep people off the dark side, but I mean, you know, again, perfect neutrality. Well, not perfect, but you get it. you get what I mean. Yeah. Knows. Uh, got another one of my med packs back. <laughs> uh, all right. Well, we're done with this corner, so now we can go ahead and continue exploring along. And hopefully, during this recording, I can get to that uh, droid that we pretty much came in here. To do oh, it's on the other side. Wow, I am way away from it. Uh, oh yeah, I never disabled that crap. Um, well, I think. The path for that one flow control room is still open, so... Because I think once you solve it, it doesn't go away. I could go to that desk and disable that force field, but I'm not going to bother. Yeah, this should still be safe. Okay, so yeah, we have the entire northern pathway unlocked to us. Alright, so let's go this way now. We, I kind of started going down this path, but I, I stopped. Also, I'm going to go ahead and save, because I don't want to have to go through that battle again. Uh, hmm. Okay, that's where I was in the first recording. Yeah, I'll do that. Why not? The videos are going through, so I'm confident that, um, you know, stuff isn't corrupted. If, well, it normally isn't. I mean, I've, my LGO has gone pretty well. 
Which is more than safe from everyone else's because everyone else that seems to get the, the HD thing that I have, they always seem to have trouble with it. I have no clue why. Maybe I have the really awesome one. Uh, this assembly room, I think that's where we have to go. So I'm gonna go this way. Oh god, two more of these things. Uh, this is gonna be a long battle. Alright, you know what? You guys... Well... I'm tempted to skip. You know what? I'm gonna skip. Hold on a sec. Alright, heal you up. One more skip. Wait a minute. What is... Oh, son of a... And he's off, too! Oh! If I knew it was that sooner, this would make this so much easier! <laughs> oh my god! I am actually kind of angry with myself right now. I really should have looked through that. Alright, here it is. Again, or not. Take that. Wow, this is actually really stupid. I... Well, that's what I get for not exploring my, um, options prior. Damn. I should have. I... Oh boy. Alright, well... At least I know I have that now so I can get through those guys a little bit quicker. I'm gonna wait up again, so I'm gonna have to cut more out of the video. Well, I, I was gonna cut after the battle anyways, but anyways, I'm gonna let my force points recover, and I'll see you when I'm ready to go, guys. So, well, I'll tell you real quick. Alright, there we go. Alright, so, be back in a sec. Alright, I think I'm about good to go. So, actually, I want to go down here first. Why not? Uh, ooh, faulty wardroid. I actually have to do a number of prepare parts. Alright, let me... Well, yeah, I can turn you on, I guess. Um, you know what? Wow, I really have a high enough thing, so I'm just going to turn everything on. Because I actually have quite a bit of repair parts. Oh, he's going to go straight into there. They're like a champ. Alright. Uh, let's clear... Let's help them. If I'll actually move. <laughs> go, little droid, go! Yeah, let's get the Grenadier, because the Grenadier is actually probably going to be the hard one to kill. Or rather, he's the one that does the most amount of damage because he has to drink an shit. And look at it. It's good that we have lightsabers because we're reflecting all of these blast results. Alright, one of them went down. Two of them went down. One of the droids in here went down. So we're going to do this pretty quickly. Yeah, see, look at that. He threw one of those. Or maybe it was another guy. I don't know. Anyways, he's dead. Uh, let's get the trooper out of the way. Wait, where's my friend? Oh no, don't tell me he died. Aw, he didn't make it. Oh well. Well, that stinks. I should have kept an eye on him. Uh, let's get this stuff in here first. Ooh, that's some good stuff for T3. And HK, technically. Uh, there was remains. Yeah, there they are. Okay. Sunray. Ah, that was lame. Alright, let's touch the broken droid. And we got the data module. So that's the thing that we need to get the Republic. So, yeah, we're all set there. Uh, first off, let me heal. And let me see what these things are for T3. Let's see. Ooh, put... Oh, damn. Those are good. Those are actually really... What does this do? Oh, wow. <laughs> wow, I got the lame one, and now I have the super good one. That's amazing. Alright, so, yeah, I've just upped T3's computer use by 6 and his security by 4, so... Damn. Yeah, that's definitely something that would be useful for T3 more than HK, because HK doesn't have any of those stats. Also, what is over here? Oh god, more of you guys. Well, at least I know I have disabled droid now, so I'm gonna take you on first. Hopefully, alright, everyone's catching up. I'm reflecting some of these blasters. Alright, so now we'll target him, and now we'll start... Wow, he actually has advanced saber move, too. Uh, let's start using, uh... Hmm? Yeah. This is, um... Yeah, let's focus everyone on this droid here. And then, I guess I can just crit strike with me. Sorry, I'll go through anyways. But yeah, whenever this guy turns back on, I'll just disable him again. 
small. Because the same one can seem to improve my accuracy too. Or not. Uh, I think I'm just having shit attack checks or something. I mean, to be honest, uh, I've looked at it a little bit, and the, the combat system for this game is kind of like a, um... Wow, that blew him back. Uh, it's kind of like Dungeons & Dragons in a way, because you have the DC-20 and everything like that, so... This whole game is essentially one big Dungeons & Dragons thing with Star Wars. <laughs> at least I think, I don't know. That is a game that I need to try one day. Like, I've never actually played Dungeons & Dragons ever. Then again, I've never really known anyone to ever play it, because... You know, us and our crazy Xboxes. <laughs> Alright, so... Come on, be an experience. Maybe there's a uh, Dungeons & Dragons club down in Grenada. I don't know. I hope this book comes out to be fun. It should be. Um, also, I think... Uh, I do want to do some cutting out, but I'm gonna go ahead and end, end the video off here because <laughs> I'm gonna keep that one part of the base as a cliffhanger. So this is Guy Kush and I with Let's Play Star Wars: Knights of the Old Republic, and in the next episode, we're going to finish up the base of the Sith and basically find out what's behind here. It's probably nothing, but I'm gonna check it anyways. I'm gonna see you then, guys.